Another chance then for Ronnie O'Sullivan. Four times the winner of this UK Championship. Last uh, victory was 2007, Five. so seven years ago now. Of course, his first was the week before he turned 18 in 1993, 21 years ago. Six. was looking, of course, to Eleven. win the sixth world title this year, but uh, came up short in the final against Mark Selby. But five Masters as well, it's a very, very impressive haul. That's the uh, pot success. It's crept up a little for O'Sullivan. Obviously, the century helped in the last frame. Line's well, down at 74%. Just fancy the way this is going, David. It's expected to be 6-1. And Pisa must be very, very disappointed. Mm -hmm. and, you know, he's playing the most talented, gifted 70. player we've ever seen, and you've got to try and pump yourself up for that one. 18. And to be honest, he hasn't brought anything to the party. It's not a criticism, it's just an observation. 20. Twenty-one. Big target. That's yeah, okay, I think. Yeah, nicely done. Nice he's on this red. He's opened them all up here. This could be five-one. Would you believe it? Ronnie O'Sullivan, 23. Well, he, he seemed to have kind of done the hard work getting them open. But uh, he's missed that one. Just what I was thinking. Yes, he's certainly not been uh, at his brilliant best all evening. He's played well enough to lead 4-1. question is whether lines can find any improvement. We didn't think Nigel Bond would last night, of course he did. From 5-0 down to Barry Hawkins. And he's on the green here. One. Five. Two hours playing time. Pink uh, not exactly clean. Just wiped its feet a yeah. little bit. His highest break, 45 in frame four, the frame he won.
19. Twenty-five. Well, clearly could have done without that. Thirty. Wanted to be the other side of the blue to start with, but uh, obviously then needed to avoid the green. Wanted to be the other side of the blue to start with, but uh, obviously then needed to avoid the green. Peter Lines, 30. So that's the end of that break at uh, just 30. He leads by eight points. There's to confirm the highest break, so Sullivan the 106 in the last frame, lines in the pre previous one, frame four. But when O'Sullivan has had to play safety, he's played good safety, he's been disciplined, patient. Indeed, uh, in frame four he played on for two snoogers on the pink, which you certainly don't always see. He got one of them. Oh no, <laughs> I just about got away with that one. Oh, maybe not. What a great pot. It's okay. One. Does he have the angle to get onto this red? Might play it with top spin actually, off the side cushion. Well, he had enough angle. He hasn't played that very well. Not amused by that one. Eight. Running O'Sullivan, eight. Well, the points are level. And Peter still has every chance to put this frame on the board. Well, that's unusual. You don't often see Ronnie take balls on like that, especially leaving other reds on. He normally plays the percentages very much in his favour, knowing that the red is on the side cushion, though. One. Depends where this finishes. Six.
Peter Lines 6. Well, Peter nearly hurt himself. But, uh, he's going to be in trouble there. He needed to get the white in behind the brown, but uh, it's okay. It's still, this frame could still go either way. Just caught it too thick, and even if it hadn't caught the middle knuckle, I think the red was would still been on. But uh, slightly hampered over the brown. The blade. Yeah, I'm yeah. With the kiss, but I don't know if he's got the angle off this blue just to avoid the corner pocket here. If he can play it with enough power, he, he can just throw the white a little bit wider. Six. Touch hard, but nearly perfect. Ronnie O'Sullivan, six. I wouldn't want to play that one again. 37 each. Foul. Just not quite on line. The line's four. Olivia Martil in charge. Mm. Now we're again. Oh, Just going too far down that cushion. Be the lines full. Better angle. Doesn't want to turn it over though, and he has done. Well, well the yellow is just a little bit awkward to get onto here. Just depends how he plays this. Well, for me, I would play this just plain ball with a little bit of pace and just intend trying to cannon into the brown and you just might just find the gap between the pink and the brown he's missed the black Peter Lines one but he's been lucky
Well, that goes. It will pass the black and he can get himself onto the green. Nope. That was the danger, leaving it there. Well, the yellow is on, but there's no way that Ronnie can get to the green from there. It's not enough angle, and if he plays it at pace, of course, the white will just die at this end. Well, he tried to create an angle there. This needs a good shot, though, to get back onto the green. His concentration is held up, though. There's been certainly times in the past where this sort of frame would have, I think, driven him to distraction, but uh, still in there, concentrating well. Well, that's what's known as the scenic route, but he didn't pop the yellow. Well, that was a dead straight oh. plant, it would seem. With the lines five. Sullivan now needs the black, of course, so that has made a difference. Because the black is awkwardly placed. It needs to slow down. Well, it depends if Peter's got any sort of angle on the yellow. It looks fairly straight to me. It's a tough shot to get onto the green. Two. Well, I think he's snooking himself. Well, I think he can hit some of that, and the thinner the better, because then he can send the white at this end of the table. Oh, well, don't go off. Foul. Oh. With the lines still, Ronnie O'Sullivan foot. Well, to be honest, he's hit the green far too thick, but unlucky to do that, and it never rains, it pours. Well, he will still need the black O'Sullivan, but even so, it's a chance to go 5 1 up. Three. And if he gets on the pink at the right angle, it's a fairly simple stun down just to try and get behind the black or nudge it. Seven. That's where he wants to be. The black is a two or three inches off the cushion, so he might just play in behind it. There's no point if it's on the cushion. Obviously, he plays to move it, but the, there's no point. Twelve. 
Eight well, he did play to move it. <laughs> He's moved it into a better position. But this is a little bit tricky. But this is for 5 1. And in it goes, in a little nod of the head there from O'Sullivan. He wouldn't have enjoyed that frame, but as I say, he kept his application. It was a, a bad enough for Peter Lyons. Really handed him the chance. O'Sullivan took the chance.